Hey guys, welcome to the video. Welcome back to our part two on how to get out of credit card debt. In this video, we're gonna be reviewing where I am currently on my credit score. Have we gone up, have we gone down, or have we stayed the same? Let's find out. Welcome to the video. So today we're going over where we are at on our credit card debt. So in our last video, I showed you how to get out of credit card debt. And now we're revisiting where we are right now. Today is February 14th. Happy Valentine's Day. Hope you guys are having a banger day. And if you haven't already, you may want to get some popcorn or green tea. It's going to be a good video. So pretty much we had about 4K in debt. We're going to review where Chase says we're at and where our score is right now. So on the screen, if we go to the top, our goal that we started was 514. It's gone up 31 points past our goal of 548 and reached all the way to 591. Now, that's pretty good. 514 to 591, I'm pretty happy with that. That's a lot of points and it's going up because of one thing. That one thing is we are made a plan and our second thing that could reach that one thing was that we started paying this off. So, here's where it's saying we're at. Three late payments, two years, two months, credit checks 10, billable credit 3248. So we paid off. I don't know why it's still showing this TD Bank USA target card, but we're gonna have to check on that because that should be gone. Same thing with Lowe's. So the city one's paid off, capital one needs to be paid off, but that one actually only has $100 on it. And then this one we're slowly chipping away. So that's really good. Um, over here it gives you a little chart it says we're about 42% and then see gold details final score 579 548 okay so we're just kind of paying these off so it looks like we're finally getting up there um, we're going to revisit this next week and see where we're at and uh, we'll see if we can break through 600. So this was just a short video on an update of where we're at. Some tips to help you guys out is make sure you're making your payments, um, consistent payments. Um, definitely if you can pay it off, any cards that have a small balance, pay those off in full. And then I lock my card so that there's no money that can get sucked out of it. I also got this thing called Rocket Money which helps track your expenses. So if you're trying to see, hey, what the heck are all these expenses that I have that I had no idea they were just draining my wallet? Well, you may check out Rocket Money. Um, that is what I'm using right now, and it showed me some transactions that are on a reoccurring basis. Um, one was my GoDaddy website. I forgot I had that, and I've been paying that, um, which is you know not too much, so I was gonna keep it. But you may be surprised at how many little transactions you're getting siphoned out of your wallet um, because of that stuff. So if you guys like this video, please leave a comment, like definitely subscribe to the channel and let's see how we can get this score back up to where it needs to go. I hope all you guys can get your score to where you're trying to get it to so you can buy a house or get another credit card or whatever you're trying to do. Like this video, like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.